Tonight we talked to the man who designed this boat. He says it's shown great success and hopes it will one day revolutionize the way oil spills are cleaned up. We got to see the boat in action. It's using technology that's years in the making. You've thought of everything. I'm trying. <laughs> this is Ben Gerfinkel. He's a Holocaust survivor and 87 years old. He developed the boat during his retirement years. For trial and error uh, and napkin design, uh, I was able to build this vessel. His boat was used after the Deepwater Horizon oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico. He says the boat can clean two square miles of oil spill in just 10 hours. Here's how it works. Water is pulled up on the belt, then pushed through different tanks. Particle separation filters oil from the water. The oil is kept on the vessel and the clean water goes back into the sea. No hazardous waste is created, unlike typical oil spill cleanups. A lot of times they'll just put um, these absorbent pads onto the oil spill and absorb it like a big paper towel, but those pads are already hazardous material before you even drop them in the water. Lab testing has proven the boat successfully removes oil pollutants and even sewage particles. Ben believes it could help the Tijuana River sewage crisis that has shut down San Diego beaches near the border. We barricade 10 feet deep because human waste floats and we position 10 or 15 boats like that. This summer we can have a clean ocean. He's hopeful his technology will catch on and help make the planet a cleaner, safer place. If God gives me years to perfect it, I am here to do that. Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8.